Missionary College has its share of history, tradition, and lore. And like most old building and complexes, people claim there are ghosts. Let me introduce you to Matilda Smith, fondly known as Tilly. The remains of Tilly Smith rest here, in Union Cemetery, not too far from the college campus. While her death occurred in 1886, the story of her death and the facts surrounding it remain popular folklore today. Little is known about Matilda Tilly Smith prior to her work as a kitchen maid. She is thought to be from poor, sordid origins, and little background is available about her family. According to a local newspaper at the time, Tilly's body was found on her back with limbs crossed and one arm at her side. Her hand was covered in blood. The imprints of a man's hand could be plainly seen upon her throat. A lack of forensic knowledge at the time proved to only complicate the evidence that was found. Rewards were offered as doubt in the newspapers ran rampant after only one week. Of the three suspects found, James Titus, a janitor at the school, confessed only after being convicted of first-degree murder. His confession saved him from the death penalty. As donations were collected to erect her tombstone as a monument to virtue, Titus painted a different picture. According to his confession, he and Tilly had been intimate since her arrival at the Institute. They had planned to meet after curfew to engage in sex, after which Tilly admitted to Titus that she was pregnant. She planned to announce him as the father. Titus grasped her throat and held her for a moment. He heard a gurgling sound and thinking that something serious had happened, went for a light. And when he returned, he found that she was dead and had fallen from the sitting position she was in onto the stone floor, causing the bruises on her head. James Titus was sentenced to life with hard labor. Due to lack of records, little is known about his release though he was seen in Hackettstown again. He and the truth died on June 24, 1952. He was 95. Whether or not James's story is true, we will never know. To this day, the people of Hackettstown remember Tilly Smith through various events, such as the annual Tilly Walk. And every year, as local high school students wander into Taylor Memorial Library in search of information about Tilly, Tilly keeps watch on the centenary community from her perch on top of the hill.